Sources close to the investigation tell us that police have both DNA evidence and possibly video evidence that the man who has been locked up in a Wayne County jail cell is innocent. As a result, he is expected to walk out of the jail a free man at any moment. When police said this man, 31 year old D'Angelo Davis, killed 28 year old Wayne State University Police Sergeant Colin Rose on the evening of November 22nd, D'Angelo's mom said she knew it wasn't true. And I knew he was innocent. He was just a scapegoat. They might not have knew that night, but he was a scapegoat. She says she started asking questions and found her son, as he had said, had an alibi. Everything that he said was the truth. The honest to God's truth, so help me God. All murder charges against D'Angelo Davis will be dismissed today. He is no longer a suspect at this time. Today, Wayne County Prosecutor Kim Worthy announced police came to the same conclusion. During a short press conference, the prosecutor and investigators released little information about why they now believe Davis is innocent. However, sources close to the investigation tell 7 Action News there is surveillance video, possibly of Davis in an area away from the shooting. Plus, there was evidence collected at the scene. DNA on clothes left behind by the suspect did not belong to Davis. Now the question is, who is responsible? Police are asking for tips from you, the public, as the reward has been increased to $15,000, thanks to a donation from the Detroit Dog Rescue. Sergeant Colin Rose, the man killed in the line of duty, was a respected canine officer. And I want everybody to know that I am confident that the correct suspect will be brought to justice. If you have any information that could help in this investigation, the number to call, give a call to 1-800-SPEAK-UP. That's Crime Stoppers. All calls are anonymous. We have also learned that Davis had health issues that may indicate there was no way he could have committed this crime. Coming up on 7 Action News at 5, you'll hear from a friend who wants you to know about that as he works to clear his friend's name. Reporting live in Detroit, Kim Russell, the Now Detroit.